Hey, how's it going? Coming to you from Clarendon, Texas, rest area today. And I want to talk about commitment and support versus being in the mix, being a part of what's going on. And I've had this policy my entire life, and sometimes it's gotten me into trouble but it's just the way I am. For instance, the people that have emergencies, I don't, I don't understand this, but if someone told me that their house was on fire, I'd say call the fire department. So say you have your significant other and the house is on fire and they call you, what are you gonna do about it? There's absolutely nothing you can do. And the first question, I'm gonna ask is well have you called the fire department if you had a broken leg would you come and tell me <laughs> or would you go to a doctor wow look at that sunset anyway that's just the way I see things I remember I got into it on social media one time with a woman who was complaining that someone called him or called her at 2 o'clock in the morning and I'm thinking well, why did you answer the phone? And why do you have a phone in your bedroom in the first place? I always say there's only two things I do in a bedroom. Talking on the phone ain't one of them. Okay? So, if you have a phone and it is on and the ringer is on and you answer it, that is the definition of being available. Okay? There's, there's that. But someone mentioned today that their family was locked out of a car. And dude's working and they call him and say, Hey, you know, we locked the keys out of the car. We need, we need help. It's like, okay. So he's got to drop what he's doing and go out there and handle the situation. First thing that comes to my mind is, did you call AAA? And then I thought, wait a minute, do you have AAA? Because you might not. And if you don't, then you got a bigger problem there. But the point is calling someone for help. And this is, to me, in the area, of, it's the same type of thing as being supportive of your partner's home business. If you're... You have an online marketing business or your partner does and you support them that's the kind of things they hear over there cheering for them and stuff or you're in the mix with them and this goes beyond support that's teamwork that's here we are doing this thing so that we can make things happen and the reason I thought about this is because my girl rocket got locked out of the car the other day and she did not call me because I was on the job doing my thing. She understands, hey, he can't do anything about this anyway. Even if he could come over here from where he is, which is impossible, what's he going to do? So she called AAA and the guy rolls out there. It took just a few minutes. He wasn't very far away. Opened the car. Everything's cool. I didn't know anything about it until it was all over. That is how you are involved. You will, you take care of things and make things happen as part of the team. Not always running to the other side going, help, help, I got to get this done. I don't know what to do. I used to use this example of the show McClintock where... John Wayne is in there, and I forget the names of the, the the women, his daughter and his wife. But his daughter was bad mouthing his wife, and they never got divorced, but they were separated. And anyway, she was talking crap about her mother, and John Wayne tells her, "Look, when we rolled out here several years ago." And we're, in, we're all we got is each other, and we got our little place here, and we were attacked by the Indians, and she was right there with me, reloading the rifles and shooting out the, 
and shooting at the attackers to defend this property. So before you start bad mouthing your mother, you should find out what kind of woman she is. This is exactly what I'm talking about. And it doesn't have to be that the woman is supposed to be in the supporting role or anything like that. It's just the point of the difference between supporting someone and being in the fight. That's what I'm thinking about today because it was brought up by the by the phone call that some guy got. And there it is. So whether you have support or you have someone in the fight with you or you're just all on your own and you have questions, shoot me a message. I'll steer you right. And there's probably a link somewhere on this page where you can click it or head on over to the page, whatever it is, find out what we're all about. Because the support that you get, it goes beyond just the people in your immediate area. It also includes the company and if you've got a team and stuff like that. And let me show you how that stuff's supposed to work. Uh, that's all I got for today. I'm out.